first off, the mixture. Take your flour, sieve. Really important to sieve the flour. That stops the mixture from having any lumps in there. And just before you get to the end, I want to put half a teaspoon of baking powder. The baking powder gives the mixture some lift in and just sieve that through. A touch of salt and pepper. Next, an egg. And about four tablespoons of milk. And give that a little whisk. Now, just put a little drizzle of olive oil in there. That helps to relax the mixture. Whisk that in. Make sure you got rid of all those lumps. So look, I want a nice, smooth, almost like a cake mixture. OK. Next, take the seeds out of a chilli to lower the heat. Roll the chilli, so give it a really good shake. Tap them out, slice in half, into quarter, and each quarter in half, and chop through. It's a really nice, quick way of slicing a chilli into the mixture. Spring onion, take off that outside layer of the spring onion, top and tail, slice it at an angle. So I've got a bit of texture running through the mixture. I want that nice crunch in coriander. Just slice through nice and gently and get that in there. Next, the sweet corn. Now, drain it from the tin and just pat it dry so it doesn't make the mixture too wet. Give that a nice mix. You can see now I've got two thirds ingredients and one third of the mixture to bind together. That's the secret of a good fritter. So you're, you're biting into excitement, not sort of dough. Pan on. Olive oil in, nice and hot. Get a nice big dessert spoon. You know, there's one nice portion in. Space the fritters evenly around the pan in a clockwise direction, so you always know which one to turn first. Just with the back of your spoon, sort of spread them out a little bit. OK. Pallet knife. Just check. You're happy with the colour? and turn over. Beautiful. Now for the chilli yoghurt dressing. Deseed and finely chop a red chilli and add to a pot of natural yoghurt. And then some fresh lime. Finish with chopped coriander. Coriander in and give that a nice mix up. That chilli just lifts it. The lime gives it that nice tanginess. The fritters, they smell amazing. And with the sauce, it tastes fantastic. That is such a delicious recipe using a tin of sweet corn from your cupboard. Amazing. Fried corn on the cob in olive oil. You want a really wonderfully charred flavour. And when you toss something, really important, you get all the ingredients at the end of the pan, push down and pull back. 